Hey guys here for another video as you can see I'm rocking the Hitler stash today uh I used to do this all the time when I used to work around a lot of Jewish people in an accounting firm I thought it was kind of funny because uh they gave me the stare but no one's ever gonna you know accuse me of imitating Hitler I just said it was the Michael Jordan style but it's just funny uh saying like Hagen das and stupid shit like that but uh nonetheless let's talk about our video today so we're gonna talk about Chrissy Taylor uh, didn't know who she was. I went to the famous birthdays because like I always say it's good to do a little bit of background of like who I'm looking at Maybe they're a porn star. Maybe they're not. Maybe they're just another IG thought and fortunately she is just another IG thought Which means you can find a lot of things about her in social media I think one thing I found interesting about her in the, in the famous birthday site was trivia She is the founder of the leggings company Hue Impact which donates a significant percentage of its proceeds to various charities So I was like, oh wow, she's actually a good person. So I started looking up Hue Impact and uh there's no BBB, there's no like company, you have a, their Twitter and it has one follower and the actual site got taken down so uh, you know there goes that charitable uh, you know conquest of trying to help the world and be a better place I guess she just found out it's easier to stuff her own pockets for OnlyFans and kind of uh, you know work for charity which if I go ahead I don't blame you do what you gotta do but I just found that like a kind of funny little little trivia fact about her it doesn't have any relevance anymore so let's talk about uh, her social media and then we'll get into her OnlyFans so she does have an Instagram 644k followers uh, awesome she does promote her OnlyFans on every single social media platform uh, when I looked at her social media platform she obviously sees herself as like a sexual figure so it's like okay I have an expectation of what to expect on her OnlyFans I kind of understand that it might be a little bit more radar uh, but it doesn't seem to be that case and I'll talk about that a little bit later uh, she does have her own clothing line called the Haas Shop. Uh, one thing I always say is that if you're not wearing your own clothing line in your main social media platforms or in your main, uh, you know, source of communication, uh, that kind of tells something about your clothing line. Like if you're repping a clothing line or selling something, definitely rep it, definitely like show it off, definitely wear it instead of like uh, promoting all these other different clothing lines. So if you guys want to get some eco-friendly athletic wear for girls, get it. Also, side tip, if she ever watches this video, uh, Chrissy Taylor, you're being a dumbass by selling cl like women's clothing. Think about it. The majority of your audience are men that are waiting to bust the fattest nut of their life. I don't think a man or the majority of your followers is gonna want swimsuit athletic wear. I, I mean, I don't wear yoga pants. I don't wear bras. So I mean, maybe there are guys out there that want to do that. But just you know, something to think about. Probably over 90% of your audience are guys. Sell things for guys, not girls. Little uh, hint, hint there. She does have a Twitter for about 3,000 followers. Uh, she is kind of active on it. It's just kind of weird that uh, her follower counts are just so different from her other social media platforms. But I will say, look at what she has on her Twitter. Those videos that she does have on her Twitter, some of them are reposted on her OnlyFans. So if you like what you see on Twitter, then you're probably gonna like what you have on her OnlyFans. Fortunately, she does have a free OnlyFans, and uh, let's just talk about it. So she does have a free OnlyFans, and I will say her uh, free OnlyFans is a very, very good indicator what she has on her VIP OnlyFans. What do I mean by that? So usually what I say is that if someone has a free OnlyFans, it should emulate uh, what their real OnlyFans is, right? Like uh, just like a little like taste of it, and if you want the rest, get it, the VIP. Fortunately, hers is pretty much identical. But that doesn't mean it's good. Her free OnlyFans and her OnlyFans is pretty trash. So if you look at through the videos, uh, some of them are reposts. There isn't anything too crazy. I mean, if you want to see twerking, again, I'm showing these off the free OnlyFans. Uh, if you like what you see here, then you're probably going to like what's on her VIP OnlyFans. So uh, let's just talk about her VIP OnlyFans while we're at it. So her VIP OnlyFans is uh, $20. I got it for 5 Thank God it is not worth $20. VIP access to all my above 18 implied nude exclusive videos and photos i don't know what that means implied nude exclusive video and photos like i would assume uh again i don't know what she means exactly when i see implied nude exclusive videos and photos i expect there to be nude exclusive videos and photos on the base sub right i'm spending 20 dollars or five dollars in my case and i expect to see some nudity you do not see any nudity at all uh to number she has 247 posts 150 three videos photos and 120 videos and like i said there is no nudity at all in fact if you look at all the photos it is very similar like i said to her free only fans so if you like what she has on her free only fans which to me is another instagram right i mean you look at everything it's really just like photo shoots her wearing bathing suits her like showing off her body and the most censored thing you'll see is her covering her tits 
again with her arm there is no nudity in the base up so i just wanted to make that clear in case uh, anyone's interested in getting it because uh again i got it for five dollars which is really cheap but twenty dollars is definitely a hefty price because i would say five to fifteen dollars is a good price now for the videos 120 videos like i said and like i mentioned the videos that she has on her vip only fans is either identical uh to what she already has on her free only fans or uh when i mean a little bit more um how should i say is revealing is that you get to see part of her boob but again she censors everything out there isn't anything crazy the most radar thing you'll see in terms of all the videos is a guy some black dude spraying some oil on her butt and that's it everything else is pretty much just twerking content uh her stretching uh her walking around so there, like i said it, you're better off just getting uh if you're looking at what she wants in the base sub you're just better off seeing what she has in her free only fans like oh wow if i mean if you somehow for some godforsaken reason are that much of a simp and that retarded i, I shouldn't say retarded if, if your expectation is that low that you want to see her twerking for one second then there you go the length of all videos in her uh, base sub is between one to ten seconds so there isn't like i said there isn't anything crazy for me it just felt like a really low effort only fans but like i said she does sell things through the dms and i did manage to buy one of them that was like a, an implied nude according to uh, her uh, wording and there wasn't any nudity at all everything that she sells through the dms is pretty expensive so again i feel like she's like jessica negri the account felt very jessica negri like where she's teasing herself that she sells nudity and then when you decide to buy that implied nude content uh it isn't really nude there i have yet to see anything nude i've tried finding leaks of it again have yet to find anything that's completely nude of her maybe i'm wrong again maybe there's some piece of content that i should buy but i'm not going to spend uh you know hundreds of dollars trying to find out which content that she offers is like completely nude and stuff if i think it's worth it or not i don't think it's worth it in fact if you just want to get the base sub get the free only fans uh again it, it, it's pretty much almost identical to it there isn't anything crazy on the base sub of her vip only fans compared to what she has on her free only fans so uh again if i, I don't want to spend that money if you're willing to spend uh 30 dollars or 40 dollars or 50 dollars on a one minute video or maybe two or three pictures of her probably nude uh then you can do that if you're that much of a simp but for a person who just reviews the base of it is definitely one of the worst uh, only fans i've ever seen in my entire life uh she should probably go back to doing like some charity work if she ever did that uh, i feel like it's kind of fake that she like does all this like eco-friendly charity stuff uh but she does his only fans i mean there's nothing wrong with having only fans i feel like you should promote your charities and things that have the most follower or traction and for me i feel like her only fans definitely has the most traction off all her social media accounts so uh if i was hitler i would definitely uh put you in the oven and make you a pizza and i would eat you uh i don't even know if they did that back in the day in 30s and 40s uh probably get away with it in my hitler hagen das mustache uh, like always guys please leave a comment below uh if you have any suggestions i know this is a short video it's just there's not much to talk about the content of hers is very very dry uh there isn't anything good unfortunately uh and there's a google form in the description I, obviously like i say i always look at that every uh, day or week and uh definitely filter out who i'm going to review, review next also um there might be a very large leak and hundreds of lots of makers somehow commented in my own youtube video not by me wink wink eventually uh you guys will know definitely but uh, it's just free stuff that i have uh, yes uh thanks guys for watching this video please subscribe give it a like give it a thumbs up and all that shit and uh yeah like i said please subscribe or i'll kill myself